Before we start, let me make this clear. You're not putting your fingers inside your mouth. You're pressing from the outside, right under the chin, in the soft space just behind the bony tip. This spot right here forms the floor of your mouth, which most people call under the tongue. Now, take your thumb and gently press upwards into that soft tissue right under here, past your chin. You'll feel a cushiony area between the front of your jawbone and your throat. I want you to hold it lightly for about 15 seconds. And now I'd like you to take a slow, deep breath in through your nose. And now exhale through your mouth. Do you feel your jaw start to release, your breathing slow down, maybe even your shoulders start to relax? That's not your head. That's your nervous system responding in real time. And what you're doing here is you're stimulating part of a powerful network of cranial nerves, including the lingual nerve from the trigeminal system, the hypoglossal nerve that controls tongue movement and connections to the glossopharyngeal and vagus nerves. And these nerves feed directly into your brainstem, the same control center that regulates your heart rate, your breathing rhythm, your blood pressure, as well as your digestion. And when you apply light upward pressure to this area, you're sending gentle sensory input to these nerves. It's like whispering to your brainstem. It's okay, relax. And your body responds by activating the parasympathetic system, the rest and digest, the side of your nervous system while turning down the sympathetic stress response. Now here's the fascinating part. Beneath your chin, are several small but important muscles, the mylohyoid, the geniohyoid, and the digastric. These form the muscular floor of your mouth and connect to the hyoid bone, a small floating bone that moves every time you swallow, you speak, or breathe. And that hyoid is connected by fascia and nerves to your jaw, your throat, and even down into your upper chest. So when you release this tension under your chin, you're influencing a chain reaction through your neck, down to your diaphragm, and even heart rhythm. Let's make this interactive again. Press that same spot gently right now. This time, I want you to keep your tongue relaxed, resting on the floor of your mouth. Now slowly inhale through your nose for the count of four. And now exhale through your mouth for six. Do you notice how your body begins to sync with that slower rhythm automatically? That's the vagal break taking effect, the vagal nerve slowing your heart rate and stabilizing your breathing pattern. And if you're dealing with jaw tightness, neck tension, headaches, or anxiety, this spot may feel tender, and that's okay. That tenderness tells you there's chronic tension in the floor of your mouth, which often leads to the nervous system on high alert. So by gently pressing and breathing here once or twice a day, you're retraining your brain and muscles to let go. And here's something most people don't realize. When your tongue is tense or elevated, like when you clench or grind your teeth, it pushes upward against the palate and tightens the entire floor of your mouth region. And that tension sends constant feedback through the trigeminal system which keeps your body in a subtle fight or flight mode. But when you release that pressure, you deactivate that loop, your heart rate variability improves, your vagal tone rises, and your body naturally starts balancing itself once again. Let's take it a step further. While you hold this gentle pressure under your chin, add a soft hum. Try it right now, go ahead. Mm. As you press gently upwards, breathe in and hum on the exhale. That vibration travels through the jaw, the tongue, and the throat and directly stimulates the vagus nerves, sensory fibers. That's why humming, chanting, or even slow singing can instantly calm your mind. You're using sound to amplify your vagus nerve activation. Now imagine combining both pressure and vibration. That's a powerful self-regulation tool. And if you want to visualize what's happening, picture this. Picture your brainstem as a control tower, the vagus, 
glossopharyngeal and hypoglossal nerves are like wires running from your throat straight into that control tower. And when you press and breathe slowly, those wires carry safety signals upward, telling your brain that everything's okay. And your brain then lowers your blood pressure, slows your pulse, and boosts blood flow to the gut as well as the organs. And over time, doing this regularly increases what is known as vagal tone. That's your nervous system's ability to adapt and recover from stress. And research shows that people with high vagal tone tend to have better emotional stability, improved digestion, stronger immunity, lower inflammation, like markers like C-reactive protein, CRP, and TNF-alpha. So how do you make this part of your day? Well, here's a simple protocol you can use. Sit or stand tall. You'll press gently under your chin in that soft space behind the bone. You'll inhale slowly through your nose for four seconds, and then you'll exhale through your mouth for six seconds. And on the exhale, you can, you can actually hum if you can. You'll want to repeat this about three times, that's all. And if the area feels sore, back off the pressure slightly, never force it. You're not trying to dig in, you're simply applying light stimulation. Many people like to do this before bed to calm their nervous system, to get you to sleep fast and sleep deeply through the night. Or even during the day, when they feel anxious or overwhelmed, it only takes about 30 to 40 seconds to change your body's entire rhythm. Your body is constantly listening. Every muscle, every nerve, every breath. Sometimes the most powerful reset buttons are the ones hiding in plain sight, like this small point right under your tongue. So tonight, I challenge you. Take a moment, press this spot gently, breathe slowly, and feel your body remember how to relax. Your brain will thank you. Stay healthy, stay balanced, and keep sharing the gift of knowledge. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please share it with your friends and family. Leave your comments below. And most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.